Governor of Ayala State, and His Excellency the Deputy Governor of Ayala State. Honorable Governor of Ayala, the Deputy Chief of Sacramento House, the Speaker of the Peace. I'm here basically to sell a new vision, a vision that we can change the paradigm by adopting new approaches to the struggle. It can't just be protest, protest all the time. Um, I think it's important to underline that a toxic environment is identical to development. And so, even when we think we are right, it's important that we do not shoot ourselves in the foot. My message is that we should adopt a more entrepreneurial approach to our issues, because without development, a host of the young guy ones who are coming will have no work to do. And so that's in a nutshell why we came. Today we went to Kayama to to our training institution there uh, to see things for myself. And um, I have a different perspective of what the narrative was in the office. Amnesty is a program that, for those of us who are from the Niger Delta, some will even ask ourselves, what have we done to be granted amnesty? What actually is the reason for amnesty? So if we cast our minds back, you will all agree with me that we are a people who have been neglected. We are a people who have been raped. We are a people who have been blackened out, and we decided to take our destiny in our hands. From the days of Adakaburu to the days of the Dapa Bries, and now it is going to our own turn. What are we adding in this struggle of the liberation of the Ijo man, nay, the Niger Delta man? We have seen the phase of militancy. We are moving away from that phase to the phase of engagement and dialogue. My brother, this government is prepared to dialogue with our youths.